Dude, I haven't wanted to just reach through a screen and hug someone like that in a long time, bro. Yo, 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 what up? It's Fish Tank, and we back with another reaction. And man, I've been getting this in the comments millions and millions and millions of times. 68, 68, 68, 68, 68 by Nolan Taylor. So I got to check this out. I pulled it up, and right away, I'm just like, what's this guy gonna do <laughs> i can already tell it's probably gonna be like maybe some kind of folky country i don't know i'm not sure never heard the guy but uh we're gonna give it a shot if you've been enjoying my videos please hit that like button please hit the subscribe button and you know what it is let's check it out nolan taylor 68 Let's, let's break that down real quick. Hold up. So, he's just got a capo on the second fret, it looked like. And then A minor. G. F. Let's check it out. What do we got? What do we got, Nolan? Lighting up cigarettes Ooh. in the seventh grade. It's what my mother taught me. Hold on, hold on. She was hold falling. On. Okay, wait. <laughs> I feel like this is going to be way more serious than I thought. And he did a chord change there. It went. G, F. But when he started singing, I think he did something different. Lighting up cigarettes in the seventh grade. That's what my mother taught me. All right, yeah, hold on. So he went A. Lighting up cigarettes in the se E minor seventh grade. G. That's what my mother taught me. F. Ooh, I like that. All right, I can already tell you I'm going to really like this song. Okay, let's get into it. I'm going to pay attention to these lyrics because it sounds intense right off the bat. Lighting up cigarettes in the seventh grade. That's what my mother taught me. Oof. She was falling asleep, driving down 68. Drove just to get us back safe. Mm. Wishing hard. I could escape. We say wishing hard I could escape. Right there, he's painting the picture for us, man. Lighting up cigarettes uh, in the seventh grade. That's what his mother taught him. And he said he's talking about, I think he's in the car with her and she's falling asleep while driving and he's just trying to get back home safe, wishing hard that he could escape. This is going to be tough, I think. Tripping down all the steps of the local school bus Wishing I didn't have to go home mm. Oven was heating the house If our electric was on I hope dad left money for us Cause three days and I haven't had much Oh, tough, bro What do you say right there, though? Hold on, I missed one word house. Have to go home. Oven was heating the house. If our electric was on. Oh, uh, he was said it the oven was heating the house if the electric was on. Dad didn't leave much. Oh man. This is tough, bro. I hope dad left money for us. Cause three days and I haven't had much. Mm. I'm tired of being nice I just don't have it inside me I can't take much more shit from you Oh, he's hurt and I have cut you out of my life You love me when you need a high I'm done spending my money on you <sighs> Is he still talking about his mom right there? Because he was saying, hey, I'm tired of being nice 
You know, I can't take this this crap from you no more. I cut you out of my life, and, I, and I'm not giving you anymore. You're only nice to me when you want to get high. Damn. That's freaking tough. Hold on, hold on. I, I want to read these lyrics. Hold up. I'm tired of being nice. I'm tired of being nice. I just don't have it inside me. I can't take much more from you. And I have cut you out of my life. Love me when you need a high. I'm done spending my money on you. Bro, Nolan, I'm... Man. Songs like this, bro. It's gonna touch a lot of people. I see why y'all keep sending me this one. Damn. I want to hear that chorus again. Being nice, I just don't, I haven't had it much. And I'm tired of being nice, I just don't have it inside me. I can't take much more shit from you. <sighs> and I have cut you out of my life. You love me when you need a high. I'm done spending my money on you. Damn, bro. That's deep right there. There's a lot of people in this world that deal with family members um, that uh, that are addicts, and it's hard. It's hard to cut them out of your life, bro. And and you finally get to this point, like, hey, man, I'm done helping you. I'm done giving you money. I'm cutting you out of my life. The only time that you're ever around is when you need something or want to get another fix, dude. I'm feeling this, man. I've I've been through it with, with, with family members and really good friends, and this is tough, bro. Oh, and if dad was on, then boy, we were gone, driving. Cause we had peace of mind If she couldn't find us We're all constantly on the move Come on, Nolan My whole life I've been running from you Woo! With with everything in a whole, man, the the progression with these A minor, with the, starting off with the A minor, going into the E minor, it's it's that minor dark feeling right away. It's got my attention. It, I feel like it's something very like he's gonna say something very important. Then he does say something very important, and he's talking about something that's very real and is and is very common. More common than than you would know if if you lived if you've had a really good upbringing and you don't know anything about this stuff. This is very real, man. Um, and, and then just the way he's dressed, he's just he's authentic. I like that shot where it zoomed in on his shoe, on his shoe right here. It was such a beautiful thought because he's not flashy. Look at him. He's just this is who I am, man. I'm just. These are the shoes that I'm wearing. To me, this was one of the most important shots of this this video right here. It just as soon as it went to the shoes, I just felt it, man. I just I felt this video. You know, if you've if you've been raised in a in a upbringing where there's either drugs or alcohol involved, um, whether it be your immediate family or close family, and you're around it, like, dude, I between my friends and some of my family, I I grew up pretty good, like. Like, my family had its deals, but, like, cousins and and some of my best friends growing up, I was around their places a lot, man, and, and I seen this kind of action firsthand, and and it it definitely hits. And this, this shot right here, man, just 
I wasn't expecting this coming out of this dude, man. This is great. This is very great songwriting, storytelling, and it's beautiful. His voice is beautiful. I love how he started ramping it up with that raspy rawness. Listen. Got you out of my heart. You love me when you need a heart. Not spending my money on you. Yeah, I'm done now and I'm through with you. Man, right there, Nolan, bro. Nolan, I felt that. Man. More people need to hear this song. This is amazing. I'm through with you. Damn, Nolan, you just you just put <coughs> up. And I'm through with you. Dude, I haven't wanted to just reach through a screen and hug someone like that in a long time, bro. You bro. You got me teared up on that one. I felt I felt your pain right there, man. I felt that. That was emotion. That was raw emotion coming out of there. Wow. Like I said, I haven't wanted to reach through the screen and just hug someone so much as like I want to hug this guy right now. Nolan Taylor. Holy smoke. I, I legit just about cried right there. I held it in, but man, I wanted to. I wanted to let me know what else this guy's got that I need to hear. Nolan Taylor, 68, beautiful song, beautiful lyrics. I'm going to go learn that one on the guitar ASAP. I want to I wanna be able to play and sing that one. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. You know what it is. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.